and welcome back friends for reading time with CJ thank you so much for joining me today I'm so happy to see you girls and boys and are you ready to read along with me are you ready to see what's in my magic bag of books all right let's take a peek today what do we have look at this girls and boys it's called my panda sweater written by jill Baum, illustrated by baru and this book is published by barefoot books i love my lucky panda sweater i wear it all the time even in the summer at school at dance class i'm a panda bear everywhere I don't care if the other kids laugh. All I need to do is pull up my panda hood and right away, everything feels better. But my lucky panda sweater starts to shrink or maybe I'm growing. One day it doesn't fit anymore. Mama suggests I put it in the box of clothes to give away. Now that you're older, she says, it's time to share your lucky clothes with others. That makes me think. I start to notice what people wear. I wonder about the stories behind their clothes. I notice that Mr. Arnaz's shoes are much too big. Maybe they're lucky too. Maybe a clown gave them to him giant shoes so he can take giant steps towards happiness. At the market, Somia the spoon seller always wears the same scarf. Maybe Dr. Mullins gave it to her on a rainy day. He makes her smile so she doesn't mind if the scarf doesn't match her outfit. At school, Ziggy always wears the same sports shirt. Maybe his superstar, Uncle Ken, gave him that shirt to remind him that he's a star too. Then one day, I see my lucky panda sweater again. Under the hood, I see a girl with tired eyes. She sits next to me. She doesn't say a word. Our desk shakes a little as she scribbles hard in her notebook. I wonder what her story is. I want to tell her the story of my panda sweater, that it brings good luck, that I'm glad she has it now, and I hope she'll always feel safe inside it too. When the bell rings, everyone runs out to the playground, except us. I smile at my panda friend. She smiles back. In our empty classroom, I turn on some music. We dance together. A few people are watching, maybe even laughing at us, but we don't care. We are panda bears and we are not alone. Wow, girls and boys, that is a wonderful book. I hope you enjoyed this book today just as much as I did. And I can't wait to see you next time so that we can read more books together. And if you'd like to purchase a copy of this book for your collection at home, you can find the link to it in my description box below. Thank you so much for joining me. See you next time. Bye bye.